Hello everyone. On behalf of the Natural Hazard Center, the National Science Foundation Supported Converge Facility, and the International Sociological Association Researcher Committee on Disasters, I am so pleased to welcome you to the 2020 researchers meeting. The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how our virtual platform works and point out some of the key functions that will help you to maximize your researchers meeting experience. Before I do though, let me encourage you to schedule breaks from the content throughout the day. Our program allows intervals in between sessions, which will hopefully allow you to move away from the screen for a bit. If you need more time than the schedule allows, no problem. Most sessions will be viewable through the virtual portal until September 1st, 2020, so you can revisit anything that you miss. We recommend that you use your researchers meeting portal by using your Google Chrome internet browser, and this will help ensure that you have the best experience possible. Now to begin our demonstration, I will share my screen and take you through some of the key features you can use during this week's event. When first entering your virtual portal by following the instructions and the email you received about the researchers meeting login, you will always enter through the lobby. You can navigate back to this area by at any time by using the left hand toolbar here. On the left hand side of the screen, you will see the social media feed of posts that are already coming in from and about the researchers meeting. And on this area here, this is for any announcements that we have that will be uh, posted throughout the researchers meeting. On the right hand side of this screen, this is the first opportunity for networking. And this is a public lobby chat where you can post anything that you would like everybody that attends the researchers meeting to see. Next, I'd like to show you where the sessions are hosted for all of the content from the researchers meeting. And additionally, I would like to point out if you press the refresh button at any time, you will pop back to the lobby button as your first page, no matter where you are throughout your FeedLoop portal. For the purpose of this demonstration, I'd like to go uh, from the plenary data and we will go through how the FeedLoop uh, platform works with Zoom. Here we see a session that says, thank you so much for joining. We will be able to go live soon. And once that stream is enabled at the time that the session starts, a Zoom window will pop up and you will be able to type in your name and fill out a security question for CAPTCHA security protocol and be able to join the session. You can ask your question and answers uh, through the chat function via Zoom and also see the description and speakers below that Zoom portal viewing at the top of your screen. If for any reason during your experience you need to talk to the Natural Hazard Center team for support, you can access that by clicking on the chat box button in the left hand corner, typing out your question and the support team will respond to you as soon as possible. Lastly, I'd like us to check out the networking tab on the left-hand side, where you can see that all of the attendees that are a part of the researchers meeting are listed here. You can search by name, click on the person you'd like to find, and then send them a chat directly. Underneath the chats tab, next to the attendees tab, you will be able to see any of the conversations you have started with those singular persons, and those will compile here for you to come back to at any time. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial video, and I hope that you enjoy your time at the 2020 researchers meeting.